Warning, I, Dan Lanks, am going to completely blow your mind during this Minecraft video. So if you enjoy console Minecraft, hit that like button and subscribe for more block placing awesomeness. Yo, what is up guys? It is Dan Lags, and I am back again for another video for you guys today. And in today's video, I'm going to be doing another lot house. So last time I did a lot house was a couple months ago, and uh, you guys have been begging me to do another one. So here it is, guys. Um, so I actually went ahead and cleared out a little bit of land on the top of this hill. So we're going to make a little plateau house, I guess. And this kind of worked out pretty good because I really didn't have to clear out much space at all. And I put a little glowstone in the ground to kind of light up the area a little bit. So I'm going to build a little modern house here um, in this in this space. And this is actually a 24 by 24 lot. This is twice the size of the previous lot house, which will be in the description. Um, so yeah, let, let's get started, I guess. So I'm just going to build this nice and simple, nothing too fancy. And I'm just going to kind of wing it, see what, see, how, see what comes up with it. Okay, so... Um, I just want to use all the space I can, so I'm going to start off here, maybe count off like 3, 4, 5, take it over 5, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, something like that, and then I'm going to get like a clay support beam coming up through here. Uh, okay, so that's 6 blocks tall, I'm pretty sure, yep, and it's already 3, I'm going to take this out like a little bit, so let's see, 4, 5, 6... Is that 6? Yes. 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14, 15, 16. Uh, yeah, that should be good. That leaves us some space for a backyard if this is going to be the end of the house. So, yeah, I'll just fill this in because this will be like a support beam. And then, like, if, if this kind of impedes with the inside, we can always fix that later. So, this should, this should be a real simple house, guys. I'm only going to use a couple materials. As you can see, I have some snow, some clay, some ice. Spruce wood, gray wool, you know, the standard stuff I use. I love these blocks. My favorite in the game. So, pretty much, you can never really go wrong with this setup. So, let's see. I have a pretty decent amount of space left on this side. So, I'm going to count off, like, a little bit. So, I want to kind of take this through as if, as if it was, like, connecting. So, like, kind of like that. So, let's see. Uh, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13. Does that look good? Yeah, that leaves me some space over here. So, I'm going to take up another one of these support beams. Just make it, like, the same thing. Six blocks tall. Take it out the same amount. So, uh, that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve, thirteen, fourteen, fifteen, sixteen, seventeen. Yeah, that works. I'll make it one block longer. Maybe. I don't know. We'll probably fix that later. But, yeah. Let me just turn off my notifications real quick. Sorry about that, guys. For totally forgot to do that. All right. Let's see here. Let's just fill this all in. And again, this will be a modern house, um, you know, on the top of a hill. I think it'll look nice. When I'm done with the lot itself and, like, the house is built, I'll cut off camera and do some, like, work on the outside, like, some landscaping and stuff for it. So that looks good so far. Now let's come over here. Let's just extend this to the edge. So yeah, this will be here. Uh, something like that. We can take this out, so... This will be like, there'll be like an ice window here. So if this comes down like that, yeah, that'll work. All right, so that's two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Leave two blocks of space. Yeah, that's probably a good idea. I'm just gonna fill this all in. And yeah, and then, then I'll just, yeah, take this again, fill it all in. And I'm going to kind of like loop that window around, that little ice window. I will be using ice as the windows just because, you know, for modern houses, I feel that ice is, is looks nicer than the uh, the crappy looking glass blocks in this game. But I do really do enjoy using... I do really do enjoy... <laughs> I, I like to use the regular glass blocks for like pretty much any other style of house. It just it, Glass just some for some reason works on modern, so that looks pretty good. Nice and sleek. Pretty, uh... Pretty simple, but still looks really fancy. All right, so now we're gonna work on this part. I'm just gonna kind of like extend this a little bit because this will be the roof. I'm only gonna make this one story. It's not gonna be very big, but like it will fit the lot pretty pretty spaciously. So hopefully. Um, all right, there we got that. So I'm gonna take a beam down right here. Uh, I'm gonna take a some ice over maybe four. I'm gonna fill this in, make like a window. Whoops, don't want that there. Just like make a little window. Over here, I'm gonna do the same thing, like just make like this a window. 
and there'll be like two rooms next to each other. Maybe one will be a kitchen, one will be a family room, something like that. Looks pretty cool. And then over here, I'm gonna, I'm gonna continue this. I'm gonna make it the same length as the other ones. That was 14, I believe. So I'll make this one 14 as well. So two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. Cut this across. This is only one block away from here, but that's fine. We can always just fix that later if, it, if we feel the need to. All right, so I'm just gonna fill this all in. I don't think I'm gonna put windows on this side because you know we want the house to be different i mean sy symmetry is great but we like to I'm, I'm gonna i'm gonna change pace here i'm not gonna make too much symmetry on this house i'm gonna do symmetry in all the right places i guess make the windows symmetrical and stuff like that so all right i'm just gonna fill this in as the ceiling and this will be another room possibly a kitchen dining room maybe i'm not sure we'll have to take a look at the uh the inside floor plan once we put the outside up because you know floor plans on modern houses i don't really do those i do them on other styles but modern houses i kind of just kind of wing it because you know you can pretty much do whatever with modern so i'm gonna take this across here something like that yeah that works and then i'm gonna take this up right here this pick take a pillar up right here i'll take it over like three maybe actually no you know what no i'm gonna take it over one more this way and then take it over two more something like actually scrap that I'm just gonna scrap that completely let me look at this um, I want to take this up here and this up right here I want to take this right here up then I'll take it across like that then I'll take it across like this yeah that works I don't really know what I'm trying to do right now. I'm just kind of trying to make a wall. So I think that'll be the best way to do that. And I could just bring this across here. Start filling in some of this space on the roof. Hopefully it won't take me too long to build this house. Maybe like 20 minutes. Shouldn't be too bad. It's not, uh, this house shouldn't be, ta shouldn't take very long to build at all since it's so small. Um, you know what? I'm actually going to add a little accent here. I'm going to put some gray wool. Just to add a little accent in the, uh, in the interior. I'll put it there and there as well. Looks good. I can actually put over like a little bush right there. That works. All right. So you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to do some counting here. I'm going to count off like 10 blocks or so. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. And I'm going to place a beam of snow right here. Then I'm going to do like three blocks of ice. Maybe like a three by three window here. That, that might look cool. Getting text messages. Shut up, phone. Here, let me silence my phone real quick so I don't get bothered. There we go. Alright, sorry about that. Let's continue. Um, Alright, so I'm going to take that across. I'll take this across. And take this down right there. Put a gray wool block right here. There we go. We, this will be our door. Entrance to the house right here. We got a window. I'm going to put some little light. Not lights. Little flower pot things right there. Look at that. Looks good, actually. So how do you guys like the front so far? I, I think it looks pretty good. Alright, so let's, let's start moving towards the back of the house. Over here. Um, let's go like three blocks away and let's put a, like a kind of a wall. So let's just take this across. You can always just break this and open up with something for this later. Let's just take a wall across right here, though. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. Something like that. You can open this up. This will be like a doorway. Um, let's bring this across a little bit. Uh, we can connect that to there. These houses are pretty, pretty fun to build, you know. I'm just like trying, just totally winging it on a on a lot house like this. Um, let's break this. opening up in here so what do we want to do for this bring this up right here and here that works I could put a this this could be like a door right here like I could just like walk out right there and that'll be a door and then what else could I do take that across this is gonna be the ceiling so I can just kind of start filling that in 
Uh, we can open up a space right here and put like a skylight. That works. That definitely works. And then I was thinking put another thing right here, like an opening. Skylight. That looks good too. Okay. Um, now what? I'm about to sleep in a second, but let's just do some more stuff first before I do that. I'm going to take like something down right here. Like maybe like that. I'm going to leave some space back here for like a pool. And I want to keep the pool inside the lot because I want to, I just want to try to keep everything inside the lot. So wait, hold on a second. That doesn't, that's not supposed to be here. I'm thinking if I take this across from here, it will connect. Yes, it will. Okay, that's good. And again, I'm going to go ahead and just sleep real quick, guys, so you guys can see what I'm doing. I got my bed right here, ready to go. And see, the thing is, you know, see this like little hill here? That would be really cool to add like an infinity pool off that or something like that. So that would be definitely something that we would consider. So I'm just going to fill this whole thing in right now just to kind of complete the ceiling and kind of close off the house. I'm not going to do the interior too much. I'll do like, I'll plan it out, maybe put some signs down. But again, this is actually in Los Angeles, so, um, you know, this this house will probably stay here, most likely, so I always have time to furnish it later. Okay, so that works. And what do I want to do with this? I'm going to take a, let's take a wall down, like, through here. I don't know how long it'll be, but... You put like an opening some ice here just take this all the way through maybe something like that and then and then ooh, okay okay and then we can take some ice and we can make like a curving window not really a curving window but like it's kind of yeah kind of curving window um to take it through here all right what do you guys think i like it now I'll add like a little thing up here. Um, let's take this down a little bit. So let's go like that's three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. Something like that works. Let's just take this down, connect it back to the front, and then we could put like some grass here and make like one of those natural gardens, like on the roof of like a modern house where. Um, what, what's the, what's the word for this? Um, it's like some sort of like, it's like natural energy being taken from the, the plants. I don't know. It's, you can look it up. You can look it up. It's definitely something, it's definitely a thing. <laughs> uh, let's take some like little beams across right here and like right here. Just for like, just a little decoration. I had a window here. That'd be probably a good idea. Something like this fancy little window on that wall all right so this is actually starting to get take some shape here um let's take something across right here let's just make a little like i don't even know like what this is just a little barrier maybe that's cool yeah we can keep that all right so let's work on the inside a little bit so this room is pretty tiny so what this will be this will probably be a staircase downstairs to like a like a basement area that has like a, a master bedroom. Maybe like a game room down there or something. Definitely a possibility. Since we are on the top of a hill, we'll have plenty of space underneath to like dig into the ground. Just like that. And we Alright, that looks good. And right here. I this yeah, this can be replaced. Okay, so that can be turned into this can be turned into snow as well. That needs to be grass. I'll probably break a couple of these blocks now that I think about it. Okay, not that. Yeah, just that. Okay, so there we go. We have our little entrance to this room. Again, I'll take like a staircase down through here. I just like it'll start going down. You know what I mean? So yeah, that that would what I, that's what I would suggest for this area. So a little staircase room. Um, okay, this wall we need to open up some space here. And put a snow thing right there that's three on there three on there and a three by three corridor so that works and we can put a that works too okay we can put a kitchen here small kitchen maybe like close off a space here and put a bathroom that works all right so and then we can put like a living room right here uh like a dining room table right here 
And the, again, the bedroom will be downstairs. And this will be the walkway out to the pool in the backyard. So, awesome. All right, we're pretty much done. The only thing I'm going to do, I'm just going to clear my inventory real quick. Get out some bone meal and some snow. Really, the only thing I'm going to do is just cut off camera and do some landscaping around the edges. You know, take away the like the hedges on the outside for um, like the lot so it doesn't look like a lot house anymore. And you'll do some landscaping for it. But of course, I mean, you can use this. You want to if you want to build this in your uh, in your town. Like if you have like a, a lot like about this size, feel free to throw this into your town if you like modern houses. And uh, it'll definitely be a good little addition. So hopefully you guys liked it. All right, so I'm going to cut off camera for a little bit, guys. I'll do some little exterior work and come back to you guys and we'll call it quits from there. So I will be right back, guys. Okay, guys, I have finished doing some landscaping and let's check it out. So here's what I did, guys. Um, I added some, some palm trees and I did the same palm tree design that I did over in the city district. Um, just I made them slightly bigger and I think it looks okay. I mean, like... I'm not that great at building palm trees. I've only done like four or five. This is like the th second, third, and fourth palm tree I've ever built. But, you know, they're not, I don't even mind them really. And I don't know what that's doing down there. I must have placed that by accident. But anyway, um, yeah, these are the palm trees I made. So I put like two in the front and then uh, one on the side. And I think like, you know, the roots kind of extend down. And then for the backyard, I went ahead and added a little infinity pool. That's what I did for that. Um, you know, it kind of like looks out over the cliff and you know that's pretty much it so guys thanks for watching thanks for uh you know watch me build this lot house and feel free to build this in your world if you want to really simple design but as you can see um you know it, it looks pretty good so i mean the palm trees definitely add a nice touch and you know if you're building in like a nice like beachy area the palm trees may not be like the perfect thing for this cliff but you know i figured why not I thought it would be a cool idea to kind of like bend them off the cliff and that's kind of what I tried to do. So yeah, um, the inside I filled it in with spruce wood and this is will make it be a staircase down to like a basement. So that's pretty much it guys. Thanks for watching. Um, hopefully you guys build this house. I think it looks pretty cool. I'm happy with the way it turned out and thanks for watching. Talk to you guys in the next one. Make sure you click the like button. And if you guys want me to do another lot house in a different style that's not modern, feel free to leave a comment. And until then... I'll tell you guys in the next one. Peace out.